doing everybody? I'm back with a brand battle. I got a brand battle for you. Why? Because I suggested it and you guys lit it up. Literally fucking kaboom, lit the thing up. It was crazy. Yes, yes, yes. I want to see brand battle. First off, I'd like to thank Ritto. Ritto? Ritto. Ritto Mints. This video is brought to you by Ritto Mints. Not, I'm just kidding. I just like these mints. It's, they didn't give me them. I paid for them. I just like them. But this is a brand battle that I think is going to be iconic. Does that work with this? If you know what I'm saying? Because of the fact of, this is Icon versus Vexus. If you lay those both side by side right now on your computer, split screen, track, bing, bing, put them right next to each other. You're gonna see some similarities there. Um, but we're gonna break it down for you. We're gonna break it down to the point of where we're gonna battle it out. We're gonna get some boxing gloves on, maybe some throwing stars, maybe even some swords. We might be even chucking axes by the time this is done. All right, everybody knows I went to Icon, right? Everybody knows I've been there. They've seen that, done, 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 been there, walked through the plant. Got to see all that, never been to Vexus. Didn't want to go to Vexus, uh, I don't really care to go to Vexus unless they'd invite me to come to Vexus and I'd come to Vexus, but I doubt they're gonna do that. But we're gonna base this on our normal. Speed, well, performance, speed, build quality, build quality, fish ability, ride, resale value, quality of trailer, and cool factor. And I'll kind of go in depth on some of that stuff. But first off, did you get the other shirt off? Yeah. You did. Last Friday dropped. How did it do? Good. Did it? Yeah. Good. It's on there. Go get it. We still got the other team ones going, right? Good. So you can get all the team ones, all at the same price. Put them in your pocket. Give them to somebody for a holiday reason. Put them in the same for uh, stopping stocking stuffers. You should buy them, roll them up, put them in the stocking, package the stocking away, back in the box. When Christmas comes in, you pull the stocking. It's like holy fuck, Christmas all over again. Whoa, whoa, hang on, hang on. What? I saw that on the site where we have our stuff printed, mm -hmm. they now have custom wrapping paper. We could make Team Marine wrapping paper to, step, to put your stocking stuffer in. I do that. Actually, I want that. Yeah. I'm going to wrap my kids' gifts in Team Marine wrapping paper this year. Yeah. Bad. That's going to be great. We're going to do it. Do they do men's underwear yet? Yeah. Comment if you would wear Team Marine men's underwear. Comment. That'll force Jordan to do this. Comment you'd wear them. We're not going to get into the women's side of things, sure. but I imagine some of them are going to comment. Whatever. Let's get to this video. Should we? Yep. Let's go. All right. Battle brand. We're a brand battle. Icon Vexus coming at you right now. Performance. The performance thing we're basing it on, Jordan's kind of explaining, and I don't really go into it, but it's like all in one, right? The fish ability, the speed the ride, all that stuff, right? It's bulked in the one, is that what we're saying here? Yeah. Yeah, it's kind of a bulk of everything. Performance and Icon gets to it. Icon. Where's Icon at? What side? Is that this side for me? No. That's this side? Yep. See, if I turn around, yeah, we're on this side. Yep. All right, Shwack! right over here. Thumbs up. Speed, speed's gonna go to Vexus. Everybody knows that the icons but now i did see their 20 footer but this is based on or their 19 footer did hit 72 i think or somebody did a video on it and it hit 72 the 20 footer did now so that could be a new level for them i haven't been back to see the 20 I haven't been around they haven't called me they're probably pissed at me but it doesn't matter their smaller boat did go fast it went over 70 so that was a big deal their flagship 21 didn't see that or 22 whatever it may be didn't see that but so we're basing it on that boat Speed going to Vex. Swing over here. Um, build quality is icon all the way. Build quality is icon. Icon's build quality is top of the line. I would say it's probably maybe if not the highest built quality boat, one of the most quality built boats. All right. So if you're thinking about buying a boat for quality, you're thinking about longevity, you're thinking about not breaking, you're thinking about a company that's going to timely test things and do that. Quality side, icon over here uh fish ability this is where you can really lay them both side by side we really want we really looked at these two boats side by side top view and we're not saying compartments we're just saying fish ability we're saying deck we're saying live wells we're saying trolling motor placement we're saying that type of thing and how comfort is it to fish and be around and be in while we're fishing this is a tie for me it is literally a tie and i know i got people are like why i got this huge deck i get it you look at that vexus deck it's big it's wide um rod lockers if we were looking at tackle storage when it came to that, and I'm not, it would go probably to Icon because they have massive tackle storage in the front. 
but we're not basing it on that. I'm just saying fish, physical fish ability of being on the deck, being off the deck, putting fish in live wells, getting back onto the deck, and fishing with a, with a platform. So they have a huge platform. Icon has an enormous platform. I'm gonna say Vexus has a huge platform. Does that make sense? If not, look at your pictures, go look at them. Um, but it's a tie. I have never been a guy, because I'm up here in the river, you don't fish the river a lot, I don't need a wide giant deck. All right, the 203 champion deck, I can catch all the fish in the world I need to, and I can scoot that boat into some narrow places. I don't need a massive deck to run around on. All right, I can still lay across it. I can, I, it's still plenty of room for me. So I don't need this massive deck that's wide. I like a long deck, narrow's okay. Um, so in my spectrum, this, when it comes to deck size, width-wise, it doesn't really matter to me. It's more about getting on and off the deck, being able to fish quality, having making sure that the trolling motor deploys in a correct location, you're able to utilize all the switches and whatever easily. That is a tie to me. Um, ride, now we're on to ride. Now ride is literally no wake, big wave, small wave. I've driven the Vexus, I've driven the Icon, the Icon rides better. Now I'm gonna say it rides better because they're not in those spring-loaded gas shocks or anything underneath their seats. They are literally putting you on the ground, saying go try to bust up the waves and go try to do that. The Icon performs and holds water and disperses water better than, like I said in the video, better than any boat I've ever been in. Now you lack speed on the big boat, but it still ha handles very, very well. The Gambler handled very well at low range too and at high range. So it would be an Icon deal probably Icon right now is probably like right here for the ride and Gambler's like right down in here for a ride and stability and you know. The thing about the G is, and I don't mean to bring a G into this battle, but the G is going to get you that performance at top end too. So that's just a whole nother deal out here at 78, 77, 80 miles an hour. That's just a different deal. Now, so that ride goes to Icon. Resale value is Vexus. Obviously, it's going to be Vexus. Vexus has been around a little longer. They're going to have a resale value. They're going to have it where I don't even know if there's any used icons for sale. I haven't looked, but I don't can't foresee there being a ton of them used for sale unless they're coming out of the plant owned by somebody that used it for a year and then they're getting rid of it. But so the resale value is obviously going to go to Vexus. Um, trailer quality, trailer quality and craftsmanship goes to Vexus. Vexus's trailer quality and craftsmanship and lines are beautiful. They have a beautiful trailer and it molds beautifully to the boat. It really does. And I'm not saying anything bad about the Icon trailer, but they're just, they're just a bigger trailer. It's more basic. You know, it's got the standard fender, it's got the bigger tires, you know what I mean? It's got some road armor or their Vexus armor or Icon armor or somebody's armor is on there. So it, it's just not, it doesn't look as nice. I think Jordan and I look at it like, if you see a Vexus boat and trailer on the trailer, like going down the road, I think we talked, you even said it, that that boat should be getting towed by your $100,000 SUV because it just looks like that boat. It's almost, the Vexus is almost looks like it's not a bass boat. Does that make sense? It like doesn't look like a bass boat. It looks like it's it's a step higher, but it, it's, it's not. It, it just looks that way. It just looks rich. It looks expensive. It looks... It looks fucking Lamborghini-ish. It's crazy what it looks like on the trailer. Um, which leads us into cool factor. And right now, Icon, Vexus, Icon, Icon's got, it's tied. It's tied, it's literally tied. It's literally tied, with the tie. So everybody's at three and a half. It's come down to this. It's literally come down to this comes down to cool factor, Jordan. And in cool factor, we're laying on the trailer, off the trailer, and I think just the, the, the cool things about the boat, right? Like the touchscreen locations, how the boat live wells, the coolers. I mean, we take everything into effect when it goes to the cool factor. The style, the, the house, the sleep, you know, what it does. And that goes back to sitting them side by side. So. On the trailer, I would say if we set them side by side, if I was didn't know anything about the boats and I was going to pick one from a distance, you would go to the Vexus. But as I got closer, I started seeing the detail. I started seeing the quality. 
and I started opening lids, seeing live wells, seeing what they do, you would start to go to the icon. And I'm gonna say the icon's gonna get the cool factor and it's gonna win this battle. Um, and it's not winning by a large amount. It's a close battle because these bolts are side by side, high end by bolts. They're top of the line bolts. But when you get physically get into that icon and the price is super high, we know this, um, I put the price is high on both of these boats. I don't know what it is on both of these boats, but as you get in an icon and you literally start to see the craftsmanship and you get to see, you lift the lids and you get to see, there's no carpeting. Everything is as smooth, as smooth as you can get inside the boat. There's no carpeting inside that boat. It's designed to be wiped down. It's designed not to have mold. It's got a great air system inside of it. Um, it's got probably some of the best live wells in the industry, if not the greatest live well in the industry. The cooler itself, they battled it against a Yeti cooler. They literally put Yeti and their cooler side by side to see which melted down the furthest in, the quickest. And if we didn't do it, then we had to go next level to try to figure it out. They have time tested. They have done all their hard work. They have done everything that they needed to do to put themselves in a new class, Icon has. So when it comes to the cool factor and it comes to the overall battle of this, Icon gets the nod for sure. Um, it wasn't a first year, I guess, but it is now a first year, just because it's like, it's done. But they put in, and I haven't been through the Vexus factory, they have not invited me down, they haven't been let me see what's going on, and I know that when Vexus was released, when they were building that, they were supposed to be the new, and you know, they had all the ingenuity, they had all these things. Um, but I just think when it comes down to the people at um, Icon and how they have, um, changed it they literally have changed bass boats they've changed the quality of and the standard of bass boats to like that and those who don't try to step up i'm not saying you have to get to that level but you need to try to inch your way towards that with certain things with what you're buying and what stuff you're using and i think icon would be happy to say that you know we're using we're using this pump because it's this and it does this and this is why we're using it and this is why we're not using this pump we're not using these because these are the best made in today's world. And if something is made better, we're gonna put that in our boats. Um, there's a lot of companies I think that have just stayed even keel with what they've been doing for a long time. But I think Icon is always trying to find the next best thing, if that makes sense. Um, and you know, we did, we did that over under for them and they were overvalued in my eyes and that was in my eyes. And they still, they still do good things. I mean, they still, they still bring it, they literally bring it, but at the end of the day, this, this country's slowing down, spending money, and it's gonna, I just don't foresee it being a great country for a little while, you know what I mean? We're gonna have another year of maybe, and then it's gonna maybe take off again. But I would say, um, if, I had to, if I had to literally walk up and pick one, you're gonna give me one or the other, no bullshit attached, I'm going Icon. I'm going Icon for all the reasons I've just listed, and uh, basically, I guarantee you, I buy an icon, I can go back there and they'll remember me. Everybody that's there, everybody that's there. Um, even if I wasn't me, it was just going there. And I bought one from them. So, um, yeah, that's it. That's all I got for you. Icon with the victory. Think Chuck's happy? Yeah. Think he is? Yeah. Uh, that's good. No, that was my biggest worry. Chuck was going to be mad again. I don't want to chuck mad no more. Well, actually, I don't care. I make everybody mad in this is an industry. I make a lot of people mad every day in this industry. It's okay. Um, but that's why I do what I do. I do it to bring out the best or the worst in everybody. Um, comment. Comment if you got an icon. Comment if you have a Vexus. And if you do, tell us which ones you got. Drop a picture. Do whatever you got to do. This is your time. You own to brag. You can brag it up right now. You're going to probably get in a battle. But hey, we just laid it out for you, kind of what we think. Um, so if you got that Vexus and you want to talk about it, talk about that Vexus. You got that icon, talk about that icon. We want to hear about it. Everybody wants to hear about it. That's why we do what we do. That is why we do what we do. We do it for you guys. I don't do it for me. I do it for you guys. So you can go be part of it and experience the whole thing. I don't need to be right here. I got enough to do down there. But we want you guys to get involved. And there's no platform like us. I can guarantee you there's no platform like us that are bold because we're not committed to anybody. We're committed to ourselves and we're committed to you guys. And we're always bringing you upfront honest opinions and remember they're only opinions they're my opinion they're not the world's opinion they're my opinion and that's what makes us who we are and that's what gets us in trouble from time to time but that's what keeps us 
at the top in my eyes. Um, and that's because of you guys, right through that camera that I'm looking at right there. You guys make us the best by commenting, by supporting. I had a guy drop a boat off today that came from I don't know where, but he brought it here just to have us do it, meet us, be part of it, and that's just cool. I love that part of it. I love meeting new people. So thank you very much. I appreciate all the support. We are flying. We are cruising. We're up over 25,000 subs, um, and numbers are through the roof. They're really through the roof, and you guys just continue to make me sit right here because you continue to watch and continue to push those numbers up. When those numbers slow down, I'll probably slow down, but you guys continue to push me, and I'm going to keep coming here, and I'm going to keep getting you more and more info. Everybody says, how do you keep getting info? Well, Jordan pays a bunch of people to get us a bunch of info. He does a great job. And we got you guys through this camera feeding us all the time, and that's what makes it great. Whether you like it, whether the industry likes it or not, I have all of you that are feeding me in full. Whether you like me or don't like me, you're feeding me in full all the time. And that is what's always gonna keep us the next level edge and get us to keep these giant companies accountable. That's what's cool. As always, make sure you comment, make sure you subscribe, make sure you click the notification bell to witness the madness that I hope people down on Icon are now saying. Maybe Chad or Chuck. Chuck, Chuck possibly is even screaming in his Icon boat while he's guiding today. Speed, money, and the guy in the back of the boat is screaming. No breaks, baby, because Icon is at the top once again. Peace. I'm out. See you.